Hello everyone, it's uh, Leon here from Games Radar, and I'm joined by Louise. Hello. And uh, we're talking about Fallout 4, specifically the new crafting system, which I spent quite a bit of time with. You've you've not really dabbled that dabbled much yet. Dabbled a little, a little bit. So, so it's a big new thing in Fallout where you have settlements and you have to... We don't have to, this is a good thing, you can completely ignore it if you want, but you can build settlements. You can build beds, walls, shelters, uh, power generators, and make people a home to live in, basically. And you find these places all over the map as you... Uh, unlock them by doing missions where you drive out enemies and then people move in. Completely optional. The way it works is you sort of you activate the the crafting system. It draws a green line around the, the the area you can work in, and then all the things you can scrap are highlighted in yellow. So if you want to do it as casually as possible, you just go around scrapping all the car tires, cars, ruined houses, trees, ceramic comes from toilets, concrete comes from bricks. So you just go around break all down uh, break down all the stuff, and then you can build beds and food and so on and there's like a little bar at the top that shows you what your what your people need basically and, and usually they'll need some food or they'll need some protection and, and you can if you want you can just make it red uh, make the red go away and and leave and you don't even have to do that you can just abandon them completely if you want and also the fact that as i am someone that really likes collecting things in bethesda games for absolutely no reason i like filling a bag full of stuff just in case i need it yep. what this does is it lets you track the kind of things that you need so if you're at if you if you need something for your settlement, you can then go and quest for that in the yeah. world. Every, so. Everything now has a use. I mean, in terms of the settlements itself, you can basically find everything you need in the settlement. You don't have to leave it. But uh, the main building materials are things like steel, wood, ceramic, concrete, plastic, cloth. So suddenly, you know, coffee cups, um, rugs, clipboards, everything in the world now has a use. If you if you want to collect this stuff and bring it back, you can break it down into to components to, to build. You know, increasingly more complicated things. Yeah, if you had one tip for someone that was starting um, Fallout 4 and they wanted to start their crafting, where would you say they would, would start? If you're crafting weapons, I would basically take everything back to one settlement. So I'd have everything in the starting settlement for my guns. But in terms of the actual settlement building and the beds and the people, like, don't worry about it too much. Like, it, it, it doesn't matter if you do it or don't. If you, ha if you want to, you'll have great fun building all sorts of things. And it if, happens pretty naturally too. Yeah, so. and if it's not your thing, then it doesn't matter. Otherwise, happy crafting.